Asia guys, Aston Villa. Apparently the morals happy. Sharp was no good. Anyways, it's my turn. Cameras trained on one man in a rich vein of form and number one on the scoring charts. Can he do it again today, live on EA TV? Hello everyone and welcome. Our footballing travels have taken us to the Midlands. We're at Villa Park. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Aston Villa facing Burnley. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And here's the starting 11 for Aston Villa. Esri Konza starts with Diego Carlos in central defence. And so many different ways to configure an at alert defending. Superb looking pass. Well, the stats confirm it. Burnley have been the more dominant team over the last 15 minutes and have played some really lovely football going forward. They must now make it count and get themselves in front. A goal on the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, here's the replay, and it has been coming. They've played some great football in this game, and they fully deserve this goal. Now well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Nicolo Zaniolo. Oh, good play, this. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Douglas Luis. Really getting stuck in. Well, still time for them to level it. Oh, that's fine defensive play. Oh, he's given a penalty. Just what they wanted to avoid given the circumstances. And he's rocked at home with confidence. And with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Stuart, your analysis. Well, it could have gone either way. I thought both teams were very positive, though. Going hammer and song. Just a moment of your time. Thanks for speaking to us.
much.
Thanks for waiting. We're now ready to take your questions. The tension is palpable and you can understand why. Two high-level sides about to face each other and it's anyone's guess how this is going to end up. We're live on EA TV. And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. 
I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson and we have live action from the FA Cup to bring you today it's Bradford City facing Burnley well what an occasion this is for the home side and its supporters yes of course they're up against it today but how they would love to cause a shock here if they work as hard as they can close their opponents down defend with determination and get a little bit of luck they may just pull off a surprise deliver it with accuracy and still dangerous cross fired over well clattered away Chapman well there's a living breathing example of positional sense well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Chapman. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Over the touchline for a throw in. McDonald. Now well, just the tackle that was needed. Vitinho. Well, can they be creative from here? He's in behind. Not a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. Fine cross into the middle. But goalkeeper's ball, disappointingly for them. Well, this is really poor defensively. Just look how exposed the keeper is. He's got absolutely no chance there. Goal for and the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Chapman. Showing a real will to win the ball. Promising position, this. Well, unable to bend his run offside. Gilead, Reinhau, Tullock, another good tackle. Kevin McDonald. Well, they couldn't keep hold of it. Electing to cross into the center. And he. Jordan Bayer Toffolo a chopping challenge and the referee has got to have a big think about it thumps clear well 
Well, almost there. The final whistle nearly upon us. Have they done enough to secure victory? Stuart, your take. Well, it's going to be a nervy end to this game. But if they do hold on, I think they've deserved their win. They've played really well and they've played some good attacking football. And in general, they've controlled the game. Well, that's the sign of a well-organised defence. Might be a chance to break. Well, a disappointing end to that break. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Well, the ball brought down under no real pressure. Ride how. There's the final whistle. The travelling fans are full of the joys because they are moving on. Yes, it was tight, but they won't worry about that. They had to be resilient at tight. No further questions, thanks.